The whole start, the business Firestar's company is a family owned company. My father started it in 1961. A small flat started to produce our food supplements on the base of purple yeast. Last year, with 92 years, my father passed away after taking straws, little straws, for over 50 years on a daily basis. Straws is not a remedy, it's a food supplement which you can take if it's good for you, and for your body, for your patients, on an everyday basis. That makes it different to a prescription medicine where you as doctors are used to give for certain reasons. I am in the second generation. Hope one day one of my three sons will follow my steps as well. Our production is near Zurich. Zurich is in Switzerland, the biggest town in Switzerland. That's in the middle of Europe. It takes about 14 hours to get from Switzerland to Malaysia if one flies over Dubai, but or directly somewhere in Europe. We are a small company having 20 employees only. Six people in the factory producing 1.7 million units per year. The other staff is in the office, sales reps who visit doctors, pharmacies, drug stores in Switzerland. And more than 70% of our production is exported in 50 countries worldwide. That is our best sales countries. <coughs> From last year, you see Malaysia already on the rank four, Japan, Indonesia in the future. So our future strategy is definitely also in Asia because it seems that they are very open also for European natural medicine and that makes us uh, also very happy that the response is very positive. Why we are still here after over 50 years with the same product is because we focus. We focus very much on herbal yeast and we focus to follow our philosophy of the company to produce only 100% natural products. <clears throat> we have more and more doctors in Europe, both in Switzerland, South Africa, in Turkey, in Greece, in uh, other countries, Portugal, Spain, where we visit and there are more and more doctors who are interested in integrative medicine. So that's the future. The future doctor is also open not only to prescription medicine but also to integrative medicine because he's interested that his quality of life of his patients is also increasing. So not only to cure but also to see around the patient, to make him more comfortable. That's the future which we think will be in the next few years. It's a product without adding synthetic additives, no preservative. It's naturally. It is undesirable side effects. It means for you no contraindications for prescription medicines. You can give it to small children, you can give it to pregnant babies, you will see that afterwards. That makes it to a safe product, which is good to give it to certain patients like chemotherapy patients, uh, patients receiving very strong drugs which are very higher, uh, people with high or low blood pressure who are allowed to also give this product as a support for their quality of life. And last but not least, we have also scientific research, even if it's a natural product. My father started the business in 61 and he was not a doctor, he was a businessman. But he had his own experience with this product, by stress, stress product. He had Lunar's disease, that's vertigo, noises in the ears, and no prescription medicine helped. And a friend of him introduced him into this natural product based on this herbal yeast, and he started to take it, and after four months he was better. And then he, as a businessman, he said, how is it possible that the doctor Strassmeier was the name of the inventor, produces a natural product based on yeast. So he went to see him, he got to know about the process, he took the bottles back, he gave it to his friends and family, and they said, oh, I feel less tired, I feel more vitality. And for him, it was always clear, this product is not a drug against Lunar's disease, against vertigo. This product is more reinforcing the body new defenses, improving the quality of life. And then, in 1960, 
they decided that my father starts in Switzerland, received the recipe of Dr. Strauss Meyer, and that was born for the birth of the Meyer Strauss company. Here, outside Zurich, on this beautiful outside scenery, we are producing our special herbal yeast. We are talking about herbal yeast, that is our main focus. A good food yeast, nothing to do with candida. It's a good food yeast, and I'd like to explain why. The first process, which takes about two months in total, we start with the feeding of the yeast cells. And we have here selected about 50 herbs. On the one side, we use as the main part the yeast. And Saccharomyces cerevisiae is a type of bakery yeast. Contains naturally many vital substances. And the yeast, you know, is, is a fantastic microorganism, very similar to our human cells. About 60% of the genes are identical of the human cells. So it is very, uh, absolutely a good food intake for humans. Whilst we have the yeast on the left side, we do a special fermentation with 50 herbs. And then we add this to the process of the feeding process of the yeast cells. <coughs> you see here a mother and a daughter cell. X thousand times enlarged. In reality, they are 100 millimeters of size. Every 30 minutes, we have a separation of two cells. So it's a very active microorganism. And within two weeks, you get about, from one kilo, yeast, about 60 tons of yeast. The first part of feeding and yeast with herbs is finished. Now comes the second part, fermentation process. What does it mean? During 10 days, in those stainless steel tanks, we ferment the yeast cells. And followed by GMP process, peak pharmaceutical inspection convention, and hazard analysis, critical control points, which is also standard for foods. What happens now in this process is very special. On the left side, you see the yeast cell fed with the herbs but not fermented yet. And you see the whole membrane is still intact. All those vital substances, vitamins, minerals, trace elements are still in the membrane covered. And it's now not yet digestible. If we complete now this yeast at this point, go through our body without being absorbed. So therefore, we have to open those yeast cells, and we do this during this 10 days fermentation process. Slowly, you see there is an osmosis going on. The cell walls break up, and the diffuses and all those vital substances will be bioavailable at the end. And that makes the effect of this product. Here you see also photo. A yeast cell starting to plasmalize, liquefy, and at the end you have here empty cell membranes. This is also a good pre-digestion, a prebiotic for our floor intestine. We are now the second step and the product is nearly finished. This is the basis of Strauss Herbalist tablets, liquid, the little Strauss drops. We have also a bunch of remedies, phytomedicines, phyto uh, herbal extracts, and also the basis of animal strand eh? and equi strand. Same product. Why do we change something for animals if it's good for humans? In 61, my father started with strass. One year later, he started with animal strand because the consumer said, "Can I give that to my dog?" Can I give that to my cat? Can I give it to my horse or my cow, a farmer? I said, of course you can. So we invented actually the same product with a different name, specified for animals or for horses. Equus cross comes from Latin name equine, which is reserved for uh, horses. I would like to show you now a two minutes video, which explains what I said now, just in other words. When we analyze the finished product, we find more than 60 vital substances naturally occurring. We are not allowed in some countries, most of the countries, to mention those on the box because we don't reach the 15% daily, recommend daily allowance. 
you are aware of regular and daily alarms. So we have to explain and show to you the analysis, what we have done for liquid carbons or drops. For us, it's a different idea of looking at the product. Here, in the yeast cell, we find those vitamins, minerals, trace elements, fantastic additives. And the idea is that everybody from us takes out what it needs to support your body, to repair, and to strengthen your body. So I need something else that or you are needing. And my kid, who is not a kid anymore, 12, uh, 20 years old, he needs definitely something else out of stuff than my father or my mother. My father, sorry, not anymore. That is the idea. So it's not how much milligram I have for my B1, how much milligram iron I have in this product, this different way you have to look at this product. It doesn't interfere your product which you give in high dosage, if you give. It is an addition and it doesn't harm, it has no contraindication. So it's a, a food which contains the, a lot of vital substances which are coming in a natural way and the bioavailability is very, very high because we plasmalize the yeast cell, we ferment it, and they are ready for absorption. And the yeast cells are not alive anymore. And therefore, it's possible for candida patients to take this product. It doesn't grow the candida in your body. In opposite, it is, it is improving their immune defense system. And those candida patients have a lack of immune defenses. So all kind of allergic persons you have in your practice, all kind of allergies go down somewhere to a, a weakened system, immune system. And therefore, it is, especially with the deeper strong drops, a very good possibility to support the immune defenses. The products, a few words on the products. We have in the Malaysian market also the liquid tablets and bitter strong drops. The bitter strong drops are represented also uh, by Alex Bond. Food supplement, liquid, plasma ice yeast, malt extract, orange syrup, and honey. Then we have the tablets. All three have the same efficacy. Natural binding materials, not just synthetic binding materials. This is also important for us. Cellulose, cornstarch, GMO-free, apopectin, silicic acid. And here you see always the daily dosage. is twice to three times a day two tablets, 30 drops, or one teaspoon, I will show you afterwards. The deeper strap drops, which you are familiar with that, is a filter of the whole yeast cell. That makes it very good absorbable by the mucosis, because it comes in drops form. As you know, it contains alcohol. So for some people, like Muslim uh, people, it's a bit difficult to understand. I will try to explain it to you. When you go down to dosage of 20 or 30 drops per, uh, per serving, the alcohol content is very low. It's about 0.25 grams alcohol. So actually, the dosage of alcohol per, per serving is very low. If you compare with a ripe banana, even the banana you take, and it's already ripe, contains also alcohol. Grape, grape juice, for instance. All kind of juices, which they, they can ferment, and then when it's fermenting, alcohol is produced. If you have an apple, you cut it, and you leave it 10 minutes, it gets a little brown. A fermentation starts, alcohol is produced. So it depends always the quantity of alcohol you see. So actually, we use Vitastrass drops in many countries also for kids, because the dosage is not 30 drops, or it goes down by age, two drops by age. That means when you have a six-year-old boy who needs a little strength, you give him 12 drops. If you have a four-year-old, we give him eight drops. So two drops per year helps you as a doctor to make the appropriate dosage for your customers. The liquid tablets and bitter 
Windstrap drops, the Windstrap drops are represented also uh, by Alex Bond. Food supplement, liquid, plasma ICs, molten strap, orange syrup, and honey. Then we have the tablets. All three have the same efficacy. Natural binding materials, not just synthetic binding materials. This is also important for us. Cellulose, cornstarch, GMO-free, apopectin, silicic acid. And here you see always the daily dosage. is twice to three times a day two tablets, 30 drops, or one teaspoon to level show you afterwards. The Vipa Strap Drops, which you are familiar with that, is a filter of the whole yeast cell. That makes it very good absorbable by the mucosis because it comes in drops form. As you know, it contains alcohol. So for some people, like Muslim uh, people, it's a bit difficult to understand. I will try to explain it to you. When you go down to dosage of 20 or 30 drops per, uh, per serving, the alcohol content is very low. It's about 0.25 grams alcohol. So actually, dosage of alcohol per, per serving is very low. If you compare with a ripe banana, even the banana you take, and it's already ripe, contains also alcohol. Great juice for it. All kinds of juices, which they, they can ferment, and then when it's fermented, alcohol is produced. If you have an apple, you cut it, and you leave it 10 minutes, it gets a little brown. A fermentation starts, alcohol is produced. So it depends always the quantity of alcohol we see. So actually, we use Vitastrass drops in many countries also for kids, because the dosage is not 30 drops, it goes down by age, two drops by age. That means when you have a six-year-old boy who needs a little strength, you give him 12 drops. If you have a four-year-old, you give him eight drops. So two drops per year helps you as a doctor to make the appropriate dosage for your customers or patients. What is good, somebody said they don't like it, but it's a neutral taste, put it in a little fruit juice, in a little milk, in a little water, and nothing is absolutely neutral. Beside those three products, because I will mention also animal straws and daily straws, because we have also veterinaries here, and then of course it's important to hear about the process which is absolutely the same. For wheat animal straws, we have a variety beside liquid, also granules and tablet form. So any kind of animals you are dealing with, the biggest market is dog and cats. But we have also birds, they take the granules or the liquid, stick it to the vegetables. We have horses, other animals. So where we are using most is to have a good coat, a shiny coat. We use it for resistance as well, phase of recovery, convalescence period. When an animal has a surgery, it's the same as with humans. Pick me up formula of the surgery is absolute those for animals perfect. We are also in the field of agility for sports dogs or horse jumping, but the most biggest market are dogs and cats. And depending like cats, they prefer tablets or granules. The dog likes the liquid, it's the same with humans. Some like more the liquid, some more the tablets or the granules. But I will come at the end again on anonymous drugs or I come to your table of one teaspoonful of liquid corresponds to two tablets and 30 drops. We are talking a lot about gluten intolerance, celiac patients, those who can't eat any wheat, for instance, bread, etc. Then the diabetic, sugar-free, lactose, vegetarians or vegans are increasing this group, but of course not allergic, but it's, a, it's a way of living, more and more vegetarians also in Europe, and a little of vegans. <coughs> I show you 
which product is indicated for this group? Gluten intolerance, tablets and drops, no problem. In the liquid, we have a big bolt extract, and therefore a little gluten appeal. Sugar free, totally, or tablets and drops as well. In the liquid, we have all issues, bolt in hand. Lactose free, are all three sizes, vegetarian, no problem at all. Everybody can pay with vegetarian. And in the way we have the problem with the honey, some vegan people, they don't take honey because it's produced by the bees, and therefore they avoid to eat honey. But you see, with the winter straw drops, you have absolutely no problem with the allergic people. We have about six groups. And as you know, straws is something for quality of life you can give actually to everyone. But of course, it's difficult for you. You can't go and say now everybody takes little straw. You should start with a certain group. Either you have a lot of children. Some of you might be pediatricians. We have a big group of pediatricians in other countries. Because they are children, they need something. And what do you want to give to a child? You want them to give two strong drugs. So their straws is a very good formula which can go very good to strengthen the immune system of the kid. Full nu nutrition, malnutrition for instance. We have the school kids at school, students, they go at home, they eat, but at lunch they eat fast food. So straws gives them the nutritional values. You can start already very low one year and above or even lower if it's needed, if the, normally the baby gets all his immune system activities through the breast milk of the mother. If once the mother can't give milk and the baby is always ill, you can start with one or two drops in the milk bottle to give to a baby if necessary. It's no problem, we have made one stat in Germany, it is uh, absolutely possible. But of course, the ADD children, Children who have concentration problems are uh, hyperactive. We have done a study. All studies are available by Olex One, or you can write us an email. We can send it to you. All studies are summarized on our website. You can go and visit the website if you want to have the original studies. Please don't hesitate to ask for it. On the second group, all of you are also customers, of course. People at work stress situations. They need something as a picking up for or for mental deficiency. Then during pregnancy and lactation period, we have done a study with pregnant ladies with a doctor in Canada. He had a group of ladies, he improved their daily diet, and on top of it he gave straws without adding an iron supplement. The results were absolutely stable hemoglobin levels. In certain cases where you have anemia and you can't avoid to give an iron supplement, sometimes you have a problem to have constipation problems. So you can do a combination, give straws and the iron supplement together, and straws showed also in those cases that they have less constipation problems and even that hemoglobin level was better than alone with the iron supplement. So we say that also straws can have like a catalyst effect, it helps to absorb nutrients from food or from other supplements. The other three groups are athletes, of course, we have in certain countries. Uh, marathon people, uh, it helps also to shorten down the phase of recovery. For immune system parameters, it's very important, and there is no doping substances in it. A big group you might probably like to start with are are the convalescent people. Those after illnesses, after surgery, they will still receive a medication from you, but their energy is very low. So there you can do a very good combi packaging. Uh, the straws drops together with your uh, medicine. We have here had a lot of good success chronic fatigue, loss of appetite. Those people have no appetite at all, can gain appetite with straws. But don't be afraid. Those people who don't want to gain appetite don't automatically gain appetite. It is a question of what the body needs at the moment. If you have people who are sensitive on appetite, tell them to take the 
Strauss product just with the meals. So no appetite is arise. Because normally we recommend to take Strauss before the meals. To make it clear. Because if you don't write anything, everybody will ask before or after. So we say before. And in case some of your patients have sensitive appetite, tell them to take it with the meals. The last group are the best agents. The 50 plus. 60, 70 plus people. It's a big group. They are more interested in their health. And when I was I was turned 50 five years ago, I changed the name into best ages. <laughs> All those who are 50 plus, they understand what I want to say. 50 plus is a horrible expression when you turn 50. <laughs> so the best ages means also we are still strong but we are more concerned about the health. We are ready to spend money for something to support our health. Stress levels are getting a bit nervous. We are not so relaxed as we probably were. And we are still more relaxed because our kids are not small anymore, they are bigger. Or taller. But my parents always said, small kids, small problems, big kids, big problems. <laughs> so you will never stop. <laughs> Don't forget also here some unbalanced diet. I want to say, if now we have a couple and the wife is dying and the man is remains alone, of course he has a big family, but Dom in Switzerland is different. He eats very, very easy. Not, you know, no vegetables anymore. He eats so, so small, but always the same because it's easy. That's a problem where you will get some deficiency in nutrition values. And therefore, it's also a possibility to help those people with strong to have a little more nutritional values. The research we have done is proved in more than 35 publications. I have mostly, not all of them here, but all human studies I have. We have done also preclinic studies. But the most important one are in the field of pregnancy, children with ADD, with healthy people, physical, mental performance, we have done oncological therapies. That means we have done studies with people undergoing radiation therapy and chemotherapy. Not to do anything against the cancer, but to help to reduce the side effects of chemotherapy treatment. Loss of weight, no appetite, uh, loss of uh, lower hemoglobin levels, loss of hair, etc. And there we had studies that were really very interesting because we could prove that with stress, before, during, and after treatment, we could uh, help to improve their quality of life. So if you have patients coming and say they have to go next month to chemotherapy, it's good to start already to increase their immune system. It doesn't stimulate the immune system, it's in reinforcing. Because the oncologists, they will say not to take any multivitamins because they don't want that multivitamins interfere their chemotherapy trip. I understand that. But Strauss is not a multivitamin. It's a natural product. And therefore, we have done this study to prove that it's allowed to take Strauss together with chemotherapy. Other studies we have done with immune defense Stress reinforces the immune defenses. It means it's more a preventing effect. When we have in winter, it's very easy. October, November in Switzerland, winter comes. So people start to take stress in early October. Here, it's difficult to say. You have the air conditioning outside your 40 degrees. I have problems now over a few days. <coughs> I have to take the chamomile drops from Alex. I have to buy have to still pay in the, the chamomile rocks. We are doing also chamomile rocks here in Switzerland. That's all registered with the mall number in Malaysia. Chamomile rocks, cough drops, uh, we have artichoke drops for the digestion, and we have kidney bladder drops. Very nice <coughs> vital vitamins. And uh, yes. And therefore you need also good immune systems. So we are more in the preventing end. 
And last but not least, we have two stats, pre-geriatric and geriatric disorders. Interesting for elderly people, not against the illness, Alzheimer's, of course, but the support also there, medical alertness, short-term memory, uh, digestion. And for those people, it's good to have good quality of life to support their, their problem of Alzheimer's in the medical world. On the left side, you see a healthy bone, and on the right side, a bone which is osteoporotic. In Europe, we know that mainly women are affected to over 50. The cost is for us in the insurance very high costs, and you know, long rehabilitation fee. Very. <laughs> Causes are incorrect diet, insufficient exercise, or genetic reasons. The bone construction, very easy formulated, are the main osteoblasts to build up the bones, osteoclasts which are destroying the bone, and important is the bioavailability of our foods, with calcium, vitamin B, phosphate, but also hormones, cytokines, and growth factors have an influence on the growth of our bones. On the left side, you see a goodie. The goodie are the osteoblasts, actually. They build up the bones, and the osteoblasts, they destroy the bones. Of course, we need both. And you see here, just to show you, that's an osteoblast. You can't realize what kind of animals is going into our bones. And I've seen, I've not the video in here, but this is moving. And uh, this is a type of osteoclast, just eating the bone, easily explained. Now, our problem is that when there are too many osteoclasts, we will get at the end osteoporosis. When we have too many osteoclasts, then we have the brittle bones. But actually, the big problem is osteoporosis. So we have to see that this doesn't happen. We need to have more of the osteoblasts and less of the osteoclasts. Into the study for a short way, we have implemented the Strauss liquid and the Vita Strauss drops. We have worked with human stem cells under normal conditions, but also under stress situations. And we use there a simulated zero gravity called also micro gravity. This looks like this. Why do I mention this? Why do we test this? Actually, in reality, the astronauts, when they are in space, we know that they are suffer of loss of bone density of up to 20%. So it's actually a big problem in the space of the astronaut. It takes more than one year for the bone structure to return to normal. We were interested to know has Strauss an influence on the structure of the bone cells when we go on the bone and the stress situations of microgravity with this machine at the University of Zurich called Random Positioning Machine. And you see now the results of this small test we have done. You see here uh, the bone structure under normal conditions. Then under microgravity conditions. And you see the total structure is destroyed or disinterrupted. And when we add to those cells, and we do a stress situation and the microgravity with stress, with biostrop, you see here it comes up to nearly normal as it was under normal condition. Very fascinating. And we have done many years ago in the 80s other tests with T lymphocytes under stress situation and microgravity, and we had also in the 80s same good results. And the first test was done with RUNX2 ROMC X2 to show when we have control group A, we have B 
with straws or by a straw. We have C with the cocktail, I told you. The cocktail which is already known that it can uh, mature the osteoblast. And we have the combination between straws and the cocktail which has very similar attitude as B and C. At the end you will see that the doctor says here the combination regarding osteoporosis between straw and a calcium product or a D3 product makes absolutely sense. The combination is even better for the patient to have an influence on the prevention of osteoporosis. And this is also a protein and it shows here R a control group and B treated with straws. And you see here that the production of osteoprotegrin has been improved. And that's a positive sign to show that the preosteoblast treated with straws has a positive effect on the maturation of itself. That is absolutely was new for us to know that we are going in a field which we have never learned before. We have made here a test to show if we simulate a calcium deposit in the product and we treat it with straws in the cocktail, how will this be uh, detectable again in the bone construction? You see on the left side we have A, the control, we don't see anything. B was already very nicely showed that, and the red one is an alcaline red test. You, you use this test to show if the calcium can remain in, in this structure. With straws the B, C again the cocktail, and at the end the combination between cocktail and straws problem. Mitostraus drops or link promotes maturation of bone building osteoblasts and at the same time reduces the maturation of osteoblasts. This means it can help also to promote the absorption of vitamin D3 for other calcium products and it makes sense from your side of view, from the medical side of view, sense to combine your preferred calcium product together with straws. You have heard now the story about our special herbal yeast which contains more than 60 vitamin substances we do a very special fermentation process. This helps to open the yeast cells, makes these vital substances bioavailable. That means they are ready for absorption. It has also a catalyst effect. It helps to absorb other iron sources, calcium sources, or what else from the food, but also helps to absorb other supplements. It's also reacting as a yeast, a good food yeast as a prebiotic which is in Europe gets more and more important for the digestion for the flora intestinal. Then it's all natural, we don't add any kind of additives, 